Hey everyone, Silly Cat 2 here. Welcome back for more Golden Sun. In the last episode, we talked to Lady Leana of Calais Palace, and we found out that Ivan had some kind of quest he has to go on, but that won't become relevant for a while. In any case, let's head back into town and see what's up. We're kind of low on money, so we probably won't be buying very much equipment right now, so let's just leave, I guess. What's this? WHAT?! Okay, are we all listening? Let's stop right here. Why are we stopping in a place like this? Yeah, we have to hurry or we'll be late for Colosso. Late for Colosso? We can't have that! That won't do at all. We paid good money to see Colossa. We can't be late. Everything will be just fine, folks. <clears throat> We're just checking to make sure no one is missing. Well, I guess that's okay. If anyone is missing, we're the ones who will miss out. Forget about them. Let's just get a move on. Oh, dear. Alright, hurry up and start counting. They seem to be missing someone. <laughs> uh oh, we're short one person. Where could he be? <laughs> Qlex just said something awesome. I gotta open that up and watch it going on? Why aren't we leaving for Tolby yet? There are a lot of people waiting to see Colosso here. Hey, what's up? Why are the guides pacing back and forth? Come on, why aren't we leaving yet? I hear there was a landslide on the road to Tolby. We paid good money to take this cruise to, to see Colosso. We have to decide if we're entering Colosso once we reach Tolby. Right when we're leaving, they tell us we have to ride a boat. I can't stand boats. If I had known, I never would have come. So this is Jane, like a man like you can't ride on our boat, Oranos. That's it. We can't wait any longer. Can't wait? What do you mean? We all knew that anyone who was late would be left behind, right? Everyone understood that. Then what's the problem? We'll miss the boat if we wait any longer. Miss the boat? We can't let that happen. We paid a lot of money. We have to arrive before the carnival starts. There's nothing we can do. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. Okay, follow me and stay in line. tour group get to <laughs> uh, that is awesome yeah sure make the old man run <laughs> uh, let's go follow him I want to check out this colosso <laughs> incredible so this is the ocean Craden was talking about The Caragol is surrounded by land, so technically it's not a real ocean. A true ocean is totally open. What? But this looks just the way Creighton described it. Someday I want to see a real ocean, Isaac. Heh <laughs> don't we all? Do you want to go to Tolby? Yeah! Can't go any further along Silk Road. If you're going to Tolby, you'll have to cross the Caragol Sea. Are you going to take the ship? When you reach Tolby, please pass a message to my daughter. Her mother says that tickets are too expensive and she can't go there. They're handing over your ticket, you may board the ship. Tickets, please. Please share your tickets. You can't board the ship without a ticket. Please go and purchase the ticket. 
Alright, guess we'll go buy a ticket. Hopefully it's less than a thousand coins. Are you looking for tickets for boarding? Let's see, there are four of you, so it'll cost 600 coins, okay? Sure. Alright then, please take your ticket. Tickets, please. Please share your tickets. Thank you very much. Please board the ship and we'll set sail soon. Okay, this part is one of the most annoying parts of Golden Sun. You gotta go through the same sequence four times, and even then the ship won't set off until you solve a puzzle or something. What's going on? We've been waiting an awfully long time. I wonder if I'm the only one here who's going to totally to see Colosso. If we don't leave soon, Colosso will start with us. Will you accept full responsibility for being late to Colosso? I told you, we're leaving soon. We'll set sail when our replacement arrives. I wonder what could have happened. <clears throat> you mean you still intend to cross this dangerous sea? It would be too big a loss to let so many passengers get away. Say, Kaja, how are the oarsmen doing? They're fearless. There's no problem there. It's just that... It's just that... What? A whole bunch of them appear while we're crossing the sea. I wouldn't be able to... I won't be able to handle them alone. I'm sorry, but you'll have to. I can't let anyone else fight but you, Kaja. Remember, the oarsmen will have their hands full rowing. They can't fight. There's nothing we can do. Let's set sail. What are you talking about? If we set sail now, we'll never make it to Tolby. We'll be fine. We have a protective amulet. Amulet, amulet, you say. You mean that little anchor charm? That, the little anchor has always protected us from danger. Captain, get a hold of yourself. That's just foolish superstition. It's okay. We'll be fine. Even if we can't find any mercenaries, that little charm will protect us. Now, let's hurry up. Prepare to set sail. This is great. We'll be setting sail soon. Not if I have anything to say about it. Eh? I didn't do anything. Really, I mean it. We apologize for any trouble that this delay is causing. Please relax and enjoy the trip. We'll be setting sail very shortly. Isaac got the anchor charm. Yes, that's where the guy hit it. Whoops. Bleh. There's nothing down there, I think. Let's just put it right back here. I guess I can't do that. Now what? I told you, we're leaving soon. Let's set sail when our replacement arrives. The cargo is like a humongous lake, surrounded by land. So there are no waves, but the water is salty, just like a real ocean. Oh, the risk of sounding repetitive. I didn't do anything. Are you sure about that? Come on. Set sail already. Enough! My ship sets sail in the morning! I wonder what's for dinner. Welcome, weary wanderers. What ate do you see? Do this again anytime you need healing. If we aren't going to set sail right away, I'm going to go ashore. Yeah, but we're going to set sail real soon, so please be patient. When is real soon? <clears throat> I'm asking how long real soon is going to be. You're wondering when... Well... We're planning to go see Colosso. You know, my friend Oranos here is scared of ships. Oranos? But he's huge! It's not that I'm scared, I just can't stand water. I'd rather be bitten by poisonous spiders and sail across the sea. Hmm, spiders, huh? Even Oranos is right across the sea right now. Well, if we're not gonna going now, then when are we going to set sail? That's not an easy question. You mean you wouldn't know even if I asked? We're going, Ornus. Going? Where? Where else? To the captain's quarters, of course. What do you think you're going to do in the captain's quarters? Make him set sail. And what if he refuses? In that case, we'll just have to do our best to persuade him. Right, Ornus? That sounds crazy! 
That sounds great. Count me in. I don't want any violence. Oh dear. We'd better get going. Now what? You want to see a Captain 2? You're trying to launch a ship? We can't set sail in this dangerous sea. What was that? We don't care about that. We paid our money and now you have to launch a ship. But the captain decided to set sail just a second ago. So we're taking off? Yes. Preparations are being made right now. Well, maybe we are a bit rash running up here like that. Please, launch the ship when you're ready. Dangerous sea. That's what you said, isn't it? It's dangerous out there. Is that why you wouldn't launch the ship? Yeah, I did. The sea is dangerous now. There are monsters. Monsters, you say? Lately, we've been sighting creatures never before seen in the Caragal. Dangerous ones? Actually, some even came on board the ship and attacked the crew. That is dangerous! I suspect that our replacement ship might have been attacked. Such dangerous creatures around. You need warriors. It is certainly dangerous, but the ship is okay. After all, we... If they're monsters, I'll be glad to help out. Oh, really? Hey, Ornos, I thought... We have to make it to Colosso. If we're late, we can't enter. That's true, but... Hey, maybe you can give us a hand too, Sean. Really? Are you really going to help out? I'm a man of my word. If I said I'll help, I'll help. With you guys helping, I'm going to keep the deck safe. The ship should be okay. So we can set off now? No. Now we need someone to protect the oarsmen. Protect the oarsmen, huh? You guys need some warriors. You have an idea? I saw some warriors in among the passengers below decks. Do you think they'd help us out? They're from Angara, they will. Hmm. They could help us out, we'd be unbeatable. And of course, we still have my lucky anchor. It's gone. It's vanished! What? The captain's beloved anchor! The anchor. Our good luck charm? Oh, that? What's the big deal? So what if that old trinket's gone? What do you mean, oh, that? That anchor's been keeping my ship safe for years! It's just decorative, right? Even if we find some warriors, we won't make it without that anchor. We're not leaving. But you just said we were leaving. That was when I thought we still had the anchor. Why all the fuss over a little trinket? A little trinket? Weren't you listening to what he said? It's not just a decoration, it's a good luck charm. This ship doesn't leave until we find it. It's a problem, we got some warriors in Hopeless. And you shouldn't have taken it. Hey, hey you, what are you doing here? You're the captain, this ship goes nowhere. Oh, I've all the bad luck. Losing my lucky charm. This ship can't leave until we find it. Here you go! Hey, it's my lucky anchor! Well, look at that. Did you find our charm for us? Was it top the mast? Why there of all places? I... I don't know what to say. Thank you. Now we can set sail. Boy, that's a relief. Now we can set sail. Right, Captain? Mm, not just yet. Oh, yeah, what's the problem this time? The Caragal Sea is thick with... The Caragal Sea is thick with monsters. But you don't... Well, it's just like Sean said. The best we can do is protect the deck. We need someone to protect the oarsmen. Sean, you look like you have someone in mind to help us. Yeah. Someone to help? Who? Those warriors, that's who. They may look young, but each of them is a force to be reckoned with. When you put it that way, sure, why not? Can't argue with that. How about, you want to join horses with us and help out the ship? So you'll help us? That means we can finally set sail. Oh good, that means the ship is taking off. There's just one thing left to do. Oh no, now what? I need some volunteers to help with the rowing, just in case. What? Are you going to ask the passengers to help row the ship? The ship won't move without oarsmen, so... Don't worry, we'll do that too. 
Well, wait a minute, you're supposed to protect the ship! Only to ask the other passengers. The passengers are part of your tour, so why don't you go ask them? This is crazy! We need you to help out, even with the crazy stuff. Well then, let's all go to our stations while we wait for the launch. Come think of it, I don't know your name. You wanna tell me? Ah, Isaac. Well done, Isaac. I'm looking forward to working with you. Well done, Isaac. Well, everybody, let's get this ship to sea! I wonder what's for dinner. I don't know what might happen before we arrive. Be ready for anything. Oh, I will. What will happen to the Toby Bound ship? Find out in the next episode of Golden Sun!